So guys, welcome to today's video. If you are new around here, don't forget to subscribe down below and leave a like on the video if you do go on to enjoy it. I'm doing this video in kind of a backwards manner because I accidentally deleted my intro, etc, etc. So today's video, we asked the Amazon Echo, also known as Alexa, a few questions. Now, calm it down. Don't say, Alexa, stop. There she is. There she's calmed down now. Originally, I was going to ask her some GCSE maths questions. You know, it went a bit wrong. Then I went to ask her A-level questions. It went a bit wrong. And then I asked her a few other very random and weird questions at points. But if you do find it enjoyable, do leave a like. And let me just say, do you want me to do an ASOS haul? I've ordered a few nice bits from ASOS and kind of tempted to do an ASOS haul. So if you do want me to do that, let me know in the comments down below. I'm going to York University this Wednesday. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to film it, I'm going to vlog it. And I'm going to give you guys an insight into York University. Because basically, it's one of them applicant days where you go and they're like, oh yeah, come to our uni, look how great we are. So you know, I thought why not take this opportunity to do some good old filming. Also, I want to do a few videos like, oh, everything I can now do that I'm 18. So that would involve like going to a casino, maybe going to a few other places, have to wait and see. But um, I need the time to do that. So I'm currently working on a date where I can go and do that and get that video done. So honestly, stay tuned for that. In my mocks recently, I obviously done very good and got, um, got what did I get? Yeah, yeah. E, E, U. I got U in politics, E in maths and economics. And I'm also going to film the first night I go clubbing. But anyway, let's get into asking Alexa some questions. What we're going to do, we're going to test Alexa's you know, A-level maths ability and maybe a few GCSE questions as well. We're going to bring up a few past paper questions. We're going to ask her some of the questions and we're going to see how smart she is and what grade she'd actually get. So first up, we have the GCSE maths paper. Uh, the first question that she'll probably be able to answer. Sean will have to pay £720 plus interest of 15%. He will pay back in 12 equal monthly instalments. How much will Sean have to pay back each month? So basically what I have to do is I have to kind of give her a hint because she's not fully adapted to the these questions so I kind of... I can't find the answer to the question I heard. So where Alexa, she's a bit young, she's not adapted to uh, these fluent questions from GCSE maths papers so what I'm going to do, I'm going to break down the question nice and easily for her. Sorry, I didn't understand the question I heard. So I'm going to break down the question step by step for her and see if she gets it right. Alexa, what is 15% of £720? 15% of £720 is 108 pounds. Alexa, what is 108 pounds divided by 12? 108 pounds divided by 12 is 9 pounds. Boom, four marks in the back. The next question is, find the value of 5.4 times 3.6. Alexa, what is 5.4 times 3.6? 5.4 multiplied by 3.6 is 19.44. Cold. She's cold at maths, man. That's another two marks. What is the nth term of 11, 17, 23, and 29? Not got a chance. Sorry, I can't tell what you want to order. What is the nth term? The end of time. The next revolution in our understanding of the universe. Also sold with the alternate subtitle, The Next Revolution in Physics. The 1999 science book in which the author Julian Barber argues that time exists merely as an illusion. Well now we know. I don't know if that's right, but anyway. She can't do the arithmetic sequences questions. She's losing a few marks there. So now I thought let's ask her a few questions about universities. How many universities are there in the United Kingdom? 130 universities are in the United Kingdom. Jeez. How many universities are there in the United States? 5,300 universities are in the United States. 5,000. Alexa, what's the population of the United States? The population of the United States is about 325 million. Alexa, what's the population of the United Kingdom? The population of the United Kingdom is about 65 million 100,000. That's crazy. I don't get it. So in the United States, there are 5,000 plus universities. UK, we have like 100 and something. But that makes no sense in relation to the population. Unless like most people in America go uni and most people in the UK don't. Alexa, will you marry me? I don't want to be tied down. What is x add 1 squared equal to? Hmm, I'm not sure what you meant by that question. Okay, can't find it. Alexa, what is the root of 981.5? The square root of 981.5 is 
Okay, so she's given us her answer. What is, Alexa, what is cos 90 equal to? Cos 90 is equal to minus 0 0.448074. Alexa, what's pi equal to? The approximate value of pi is 3.14159265358979392. Alexa, Alexa, it's my birthday. Happy birthday to you. How many universities are there in China? 2,236 universities are in China. Mm. So obviously, if you did enjoy the video, do leave a like, do subscribe. So I forgot to do the X outro while I was over there, so I'm doing it here. But yeah, catch you all again soon. Sorry it was such a random and weird video, but um... Got a dumb test answers video coming at you this weekend.